I'm Nina Baronado. I'm a jewelry designer in Austin, Texas, and today I'm going to be talking about the fall fashion trends and how they relate to jewelry. One of the first things that I've been seeing a lot of is going to be big, long coats. I love jackets. I love coats. Unfortunately, I live in Texas, so I only get to wear them like 5% of the year. But one of the best things about the coats this season is that we're going to see a lot of great coats that you can kind of cuff up. I've been noticing a lot of cool prints on the inside of jackets that you can kind of reveal when you fold up the sleeves, which makes it a great opportunity to wear big bracelets, really stack up some chunky things on the wrist. And I've been seeing girls just bangle after bangle after bangle and really stacking it up to where they have a cuff and then a full gold arm or a full silver arm. The best thing about fall is that we finally get to layer. We can start bringing in different materials, something that's kind of soft and silky with a corduroy jacket or something that has a little bit of a rougher texture on the outside and kind of mix the masculine and feminine. I think we're going to see a lot of that in jewelry as well. We're going to see a lot of like really girly looking outfits mixed with really masculine and bold jewelry. Dainty is out for the fall. Everything is going to be big statement, super chunky chains big thick chokers and then a large chunky chain layered with it that's a lot longer. I think you're going to see a lot of mixed metals as well. You'll see silver and gold together, but even things like copper, antiques metals, rose gold. Let me know in the comments which of these trends you're excited to wear and I'll see you guys next time.